<laughs> What's up, guys? We're back here, and we are jumping into some slightest fire. So last time we played the hermit, but remember right? We got our butt kind of kicked, if I remember right. It has been a day or two, um, but this time we're gonna jump in with the disciple on a nice Monday afternoon after work. I'm supposed to have a video come out today. But I took my Sunday off and did not get a chance to record. So we're going to have it come up tomorrow. So I record it tonight. Because I'm behind. <laughs> Alright, we got four options. We are going to... Let me transform two cards. Lose six max HP. Does that sound too bad? Uh, I'll I think we'll do that. Lose the six max and we'll change one of each. Did we just get two gold cards? We did. We got Flay fighting against all enemies, and then there's that much strength for one turn. Okay. Interesting. There's pretty much a deal five, block five per enemy kind of thing. Tommy. For each replica, shatter all replicas. Okay. These are pretty good. Upgrade 20 damage to all enemies, and upgrade to two. Uh, for two turns. Okay. Not bad, I like it. It's definitely a pretty good pickup. I think this is a nice, interesting question mark. Not a lot of, you can get one elite. What other ones do we got? Uh, we could get us two elite max. I think I'd rather take the better path for the question marks. Lead to some more interestingness. All right, uh, so five damage to all enemies, they lose that much strength. Except their thorns don't not activate. Um, uh, Fragmentalize is, um, a little dead in the hand currently because we, um, don't have any relics to, to kill off. Alright, and we will confirm the retain. So the price will drop. We get one swarmed. But overall, I think we'll be okay. Uh, do do i trying to think of the best way to do this. I guess, yeah, kill this one. Well, I'll take one. I guess I could try pattern shifting them, but we took, didn't have taken two. One block. Boom. Boom. Oh, you're not dead. Oh, I'm weak. Can I... Nope, that just makes you go back to that. So we're going to take another little bit of damage. I don't know why we're taking one at the end of our turns. Oh, the swarm in our hand. Gotcha. That's fine. We've retained it. All right, they can play slow. Oh, pretty good. Blue shift, always really good, self-retaining. So it goes down. And deal damage equals to your remaining block. Gonna go blue shift. Could be good. I don't think this character has a um, like block retaining card. Uh, the Dreamer in the Archive. Amidst the Lake of Acid, a masked gate stands in front of an overgrown building. Besides the gate stands, an amnesic, Bug Quarrel. Yeah. Music, yeah. Uh, Quarrel, I like his art. Um, I seen uh, Drawfee yeah. do a drawing with him and like uh, Quarrel, but as in Dark Souls. Like the way he was looking at. Very well done. And he says, back to the game, I can't tell but feel familiarity. Something stirs in my mind, though I cannot tell what. This building beckons me. Assist me in my task, friend. It may be dangerous, but I realize there's no consequence. I realize it's no coincidence we arrived together. Fight alongside, push through, and reach Monoman. Alright, but as hot fought, and though the creature seems invulnerable, Crawl exposes its core, and you are victorious. Pinning, <laughs> pinning actual combat encounter with Curl and an ally coming later. I gain unique relic. Be cursed with Dreamer's Lament. Can one curse and one normal call? Let's take Dreamer's Lament. Find this girl. Cost of H. Equals. That's fine. And we get. Seal of the Teach. The first skill you play is played twice. Ooh, that's really good. I like it a lot. Obtain Tau. Tau, I think, is one of the better relics. And you just get it for free. Pick up your Trumpet Tau and wrap it around your arm. Continue your climb. Uh, you gain two choices in uh, uh, relics. Hands down, really good. I mean, double options. Uh, let's go ahead and do 
this. Oh yeah, the first skill is played twice. You gotta remember that. I'm gonna misdo that a lot. Um, I think what I want to do. I could play out fragmentalize. Let's let it go down in, in cost. Also, oh, I don't know why we're taking. Oh, we took damage from. What's it called? Okay. Uh, we definitely want to. Can I shift you? What's that do? It's gonna shift him twice though. So first, let's do that. Uh, this one's unplayable. And does it stay? Do we retain every turn? Each turn they are retained. All right, maybe we just have him draw again. I just missed that. Okay, I could play another defend. Would've been smart. Uh, I want to play fragmentalize just to get out of the deck. Because we are exhausted. Okay, 20. Can I just have you skip this? Let's have you skip that. Because <laughs> we will get him down next turn. Okay, and we're going to take a little bit here. So, take the one damage. Okay, that's not too bad. Glass Guan, pretty good. Oh, we really need the lock scale to make some of our cards do stuff. Apparently, again, a card based on the enemy's intent. Could be interesting, but we're gonna take the lock scales. We need we need to start getting some uh, uses for it. Honestly, I think anchor is a really good one for this. Um, but we'll have to see. Examine the seal. Oh, we've done this a couple times. I don't remember what the right way to go about this is. We'll take the ten. Oh, we should have waited. <laughs> Actually, I don't remember if it mattered because I think it gave you gave you like uh, the little thing that looks like a little magnifying glass. Oh, about to take some damage. Ooh, two, well, six. Yeah, we should play this. Getting plenty of block. Even though it would have got cheaper just leaving it in our hand. Um, it's going to be better overall to play it out. This is an integrate turn. Um, let's play that. And we'll retain the defend. So it'll be zero this turn. Yep, because I figured they would plan to attack and I want to play these cards in my hand. Play these, give them now five each. 16 all enemies. Not bad. They're doing no damage, so we will hold off. I wish the retain you put on a card stayed until you played it. Be pretty slick. Play that, take the damage for it, and we will wait. The blue shift's gonna go down, which will be a good upgrade. Ooh, they're gonna add more block. So try to at least kill one of them while I can. You can hear my dog in the background. Enjoying a squeaky toy, he's hyper, as all can be. Okay, dealing damage, let's do the blue shift. Oh, I think, I don't know if that did one or zero. Couldn't really tell. But we are fine, no damage here. We are slowly like losing, depleting in health, ow. Still play the defend first, gonna save one. Our potion will be good later, resonant call, defects, and cost of the last card you played. Cost of the Interesting. Cards you play this turn also play a ward. Which exhaust. I don't think so. I almost took the wards one. It sounded interesting. I kind of want to continue going for question marks. But can uh, an upgrade could be really nice before this elite. We'll, no, we'll go for the, we'll go for the, the relics. Upgrade card. There we go. Um, I think Flay. And we are going to upgrade the body text. Okay, let's continue along. Perform with Grim. 5% chance to gain two and Helix. Remove two cards. Oh, I'll do the performance. Ooh, we can keep doing it too. 10% chance. Oh, no, we can't do it. Oh, either way. Ooh. We'll take the max HP and lose the cards. <laughs> I really wanted those relics, but oh well. Mission Machine. Get one charge for each question mark here. Lose one charge when you go into a non question mark room. Start combat with. Uh, lose one charge when you get. I think we'll take Mystery Machine. It's pretty good. Point to Dex and Strength. Because we'll get one here, but we'll lose it. Remove a card, face the ghost. Remove two more cards. I think I'd rather just take the gold. I don't really need to remove more cards yet. I need a rest. I don't know if I could beat a ghost either. I don't know exactly what they are. All right, leap fight. 
All right, can I, what do parents have to do? Uh, I don't know this, let's just play this. We take two from that, but we are completely safe. All right, hello, bug. You are here and I do not like you, but I really want to lay the damage onto the main, the main component, the uh, Moss Knight as it would be. Cause if not, he's gonna hurt me bad. All right, I'm gonna do, I'll play both out the, both the damage cards out. Cause that also gets fragmentalized out of the deck. It's a good card, but it, we're just not ready for it. And since it's two turns, he cannot hit me. We're gonna take a little bit of damage here. One to be exact. But it doesn't count against our glass guan, which is very nice. Alright, he's got another little friend. Uh I guess yeah. I'll definitely play this. Can I have you shift to not damage me? You're gonna shift to defend, which is fine. Get your plate armor off. And we will continue through. Probably I have no AoE to deal with this dude. Like I can keep shifting him to defend, but overall, it's not as good as just like, uh, having a way to kill this dude. But, oh, yep, because here's, here's the bad, bad turn. Blue shift. Right hand for block. I need to hit this, hit the bug. Get the curl up off. Retain the strike. We need to be able to do damage. Oh, oh, here's the pain. Okay, so we got blue shift. We got no more damage in our hand, unfortunately. Guess we will retain something. That is not a great turn to begin with. All right, he's doing seven. Block for five. I could try to go for the kill. I really want to hit on this to get just the tiniest bit. Go ahead and throw the fire potion also. I think we're going to need it. Oh, we're down to six. Okay. Seven there. Play this. Zero on the on the die. He's blocked all that, of course. And he's going to hurt this kind of turn, I think. I don't know if we have the damage to beat him. Oh, he's turned into a little, a little bug boy. Oh, we are getting low. Okay. I think he's going to start healing. That's going to be the bad sign, though. Yeah, he is healing. Son of a gun. Yeah, this is a fight we can't win, I don't think. Like, just overall. Like, I can flip him to another one, but he's just going to keep healing. Oh, man. Because, yeah, I can hit him, but at what cost? I'm losing health every turn. And he is gaining health. And we're getting Dreamer's Lament every turn. Because I could do like shift, take zero, hit him. But yeah, he's, he's all the way back up to full health. All the uses of our um, like best attacks are gone. Yep, and he's just going to continue and we're going to get Dreamer's Lament. We have the pattern shift. And we can't do nothing else. Because we we've cut all the damage from our deck, too. Yep, and he has that, too. So we play Pattern Shift. We play this. He wakes back up. And is dealing 20 damage. And that's the run. Ah, <laughs> uh, quick one. Ah, uh, it stinks. But I, I don't feel like there was a lot. Like, we just didn't have the damage to play through it. We got two very good rares, but... Together, they didn't really work. We didn't have the setup for, for them, and they both exhaust... Uh, choose randomly. Exordium. Oh, we're going to talk. Let's do this one like normal. I don't want the max HP. Um, we can maybe get a question. I mean, an uh, elite out of this. Let's do it. Do it to it as it be. And so we'll just get some cards on the way there. Which is the benefit. Locked anchor. Really good. Next turn gain. See, that one's not that great. Let's do locked anchor. Interesting concept to get it. Um, but you really need, uh, take 16. Um, you really need a, like, extra dex to make it worth it. Gain energy on your second turn. Not bad, Torch. Random card. Another anchor. Okay. 
This is an end to a combat. Yeah. Because that's to get some, like, finality. Uh, exhaust a card in your hand. Eh. Each turn, I'll get any luck. Eh. It's non, it's like not dependable. 11 or 8, I mean, they're both good in a way, but they also have like problems with them. I don't know why I played the anchor. Just to do it, I guess. Uh, na, 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 na. This is just good. But wind up's also good. I think I'll take wind up for just some damage. Because we gotta kill this elite if we get an encounter. Well, I'll take the good face. Bad face. Oh no, whenever you're in a question mark room, 50 gold. I thought that was a bad one. It looks it looks like it would give you like a negative debuff. Gotta combat here, so we'll have to fight the elite on our own. But however, we should be fine. Now we're looking for crunch time. He's kind of his building torch. As you would. Lock thread. Put that up in there. Um, we want to do some damage. Uh, actually, let's defend ones. We want to get to our like. Cards that actually uh, will start increasing in damage. Like, we have this windups in our hand now, which is better. Let's get these guys offset. We'll hit this dude again. Block, and then we'll go ahead and wind up. Because I don't think that resets every time you play it. It's this inevitability to the end of the fight. Because I intend for my fights to go long. If I had another. Uh, I uh, had my thingamajig back to shift them to the next one. I would do so. Okay. Yeah, we can pattern shift this one. Now they're all in the same one. Get them in the back, and there we go. This one's almost out. They're all in the same pattern. I think pattern shift is really good for these kind of fights. Unless you draw this kind of hand. Drink. Okay. Look at all the dazes. What's the luck? Six dazes. Whole handful. A little plate armor helps, but we're still taking some damage here. Ten, I think, to be exact. If I counted right. And then no No attacks. What is this? You're working against me, game. Okay. I'm not gonna be able to kill him, huh? So we're gonna take another 17 damage. Gotta apply it languid, but it's fine. Alright, um kill you with this. Locked and loaded. Doing on 20 damage. I think an, an upgrade on that would be really good. Because I think it increases how fast it uh, does its thing. Alright, one more turn. Four more here. This was a harder far, fought elite fight than it should have been. I guess putting them all in the same uh, time frame mean that, meant that they were all adding dazes at the same time. So they just added more of them. White beasts and more potions would be nice. Uh, if not one crisping on the sides of your hand, if it actually sequence, nah. Start with it at the start of the next two turns. Interesting, but no. Just 16 damage, two turns now. No. I am doing longer term fights, but I don't think that's the right answer. Oh, if only I could get out, I could go to this lead, so. And there's no more up towards the top, so where's the most question marks? Here's pretty good. Ooh, there's a good line. So let's see. I can get one, two in this line. I can get one, two, three, four in this one, but no elite. Kind of stinks. So I can get one, two, three, and a bunch of campfires, though. Yeah. I think it's three campfires, three question marks. I just have to beat this one elite. Which of our rest? I should be fine. We can add the toxic to them if they, we think they're going to be hard. Yeah, let's do that. Throw the toxic. That's going to hurt. And then we will save all this up. 22 damage right off the bat. Alright. Problem's going to be that this is going to be a hard fought fight. I can pattern shift you to get you closer to not dealing damage. I think I'd rather just lay in the damage to you. Take 15 here, another 18. I can't really take that. Let's get you over to start debuffing me. And we will try to get you a little lower. Could be the, the, the move that I shouldn't have made. 
Play two of these, plus the three there. All right, seven more. Oh, oh, I can get you over another one and then hit you twice. I got one more turn, I think. Oh, cause yeah, I'm not gonna be able to dex through that. Oops, I think I'm dead. No, well, six. 16 plus two, yeah, I'm right at, right at death. I gotta play both these, cause that'll get me up to eight. Ugh. Is this enough damage between these two? I think it is. Just barely, three life. Whetstone on two, two strikes. Duplication potion, um, well, I think we'll go lock skills. We'll get one rest. Oh, oh, I was about to say, if this is a mimic, uh, whenever you complete a quest, get a new one. Tell me questing. Not that great. If we're being honest. Um, psh, I gotta rest. <laughs> Log of Lulin took it out of me. Okay. Oh, upgraded strikes, you don't say? And the anchor on the first turn. I thought I had a second anchor, if I was remembering right. Could have been more. More to it. I will block, and then we'll do a little more this turn. Or we could not, apparently. I can pattern shift him into wanting to, to defend, I guess. That's fine. Because then we only have to do one damage. I think he gets, what, ten? Seven. Okay. Chick, chick, bam. Okay. Ward. Probably three wards, which are all blocks. Uh, I think Blood Vial. Replica. Ooh, Runic Eye. Isosahedron, or Icosahedron. I think that's... Words are hard, okay. Ooh, we got a bunch of money, so let's make this really count. Is there any healing? During your turn, you're immune to damage. Interesting. Pick up two to add one rare card to your deck. Okay. Let's take this just so we can get the curse and... Can I remove it yet? Yeah, let's remove the normality. Okay. Um, I don't know what it is. I can take a lot of these. Lose the potion shot. Uh, pile of lightning. Drawing cards, you choose five cards. Over time, deals are. I think I'll take the bottle of lightning. I really, oh, take crunch time too. I didn't see what its weird effect was. I should have looked at that before I just up and took it, but it's kind of the card we kind of need. Retain, shatter the newest replica. Okay, it just has retain. That's totally fine. Take this. One pump pick right next to Start of combat deal. That would have been good too. Take this. Now stack. Ooh. I'll charge these around. That's pretty good. Alright. Hopefully this isn't a combat. Nobody is a mimic. You can just tell. Blood vial. 2 HP at start of your turn. Pretty sweet. We'll retain. Okay. Retain this. Okay, we get a little bit of HP. Yeah, Blood Vial was definitely a good choice. I really don't want to try to take no damage this combat if I can. Um, oh, I could play another strike. That's fine now. Okay, locked anchor. Actually, I don't need to really waste it. Boom, Ball of Lightning. At the start, trying to draw Ram Skill. Okay. And we'll go. We have a bunch of good stuff in our hand. Oh, Locked Anchor, I guess, has uh, exhaust. I should play that. Oh, and this one doesn't have a, have a, a, whatchamacallit, a timer to it. Interesting to know. I didn't realize that. Okay, wind up for 14. Do that. Crunch time to shatter, but it doesn't shatter. Okay. Hmm. I'm not exactly sure. Let's roll our dice also. I forgot to. Gain a random rare potion that I can't play. Uh, we might as well... Because we got white beast, white beast statue, we might as well duplicate the next card we play. So we'll duplicate something to kill them. Oop. Okay or not? Oh, we only had one. That doesn't make sense. We only had one energy, but it still should let us play it. Okay. Lucky rock. Each time you play an attack, have a chance for a critical. We also didn't get a potion. 
I guess the Guan Stone can take up a potion slot. Interesting, interesting. More scales. All right, let's take another rest. <clears throat> Mostly because the storyteller, one of her things is it's a long fight you have to go through. You don't really get a choice to go through or not. Um, you have to do the whole thing. All right, uh, something. Let's do something slothful. So it's a sleep to start with. Because it's a chance to build up. Ooh, actually, this could be a lot of damage to it. Go ahead and wake it. I know I said I, I should have waited, um, but it, it was calling to me. Uh, Anchor's really good for this. Uh, add three times, that's fine. Uh, blood vial. Locked light. No, well, could, does this retain? No, it doesn't. I really don't want to take that much damage from it. Can I phase shift you? Nope, apparently not. Oh, what we'll do, actually, we'll play the Locked Lightning, which I like. We'll play it, drink the wards, and gain six more lock. Wards, I guess, would be really good with, um, added dex. Uh, well, and the mushrooms. I want to take more damage from her. All right. Oh, man. Lock Thread. Second hand. Um, let's strike you. I need to get you out of here. Retain the scales so we can play it next turn for free. Oh, hand ten, heal 10 health. Yes. Oh, also let's roll our thing. Roll the dice. Ooh, five frails. Not good. Scales. That's fine. I get more damage out. Uh, I need five for that. Let's play the slime so we can stop drawing it. Because that blocks us even. Ooh, too frail, too weak. I'll take the frail, I think. Because I can pattern shift and do a couple of other weird things. Yeah, let's crunch time. Get that. Oh, it goes from the back to the front. Nice to know. 14, you. 28, you. Ooh, that didn't kill you. I don't know why. I thought that was enough. I guess I don't know why they exploded. Um. So, gremlins. Cause I got a wind up, I think I can pop. Oh, they have a lot of health, apparently. Never mind. Pattern shift, can I shift? You know, it doesn't really do anything. Um. Well, herp de derp der. I can kill one of you. Right off the bat. Kind of stinks to use that. And then I'll block for one, but. I guess I should use second hand to block. So I gotta keep that in mind. Exhaust all strikes. Uh, loose 13. Or take 19. Ugh. Do that. Okay. Either way, I had to take the damage. So. Bites at least will heal me up. Ooh. Crunch time. Wizard, you gotta get out of here. And you didn't, of course. Okay. Let's heal up. 13. Can I pattern shift you into something else? Of course not. Okay. Down to 11, but I think we'll get through this pretty well. I think we're taking slowed, which so we're gonna take more damage, but I think I can War of Attrition kill this one. Alright, and I can't pattern shift him. Nope. This is only move. Throw more damage though. Take 18. Oh, 50% take. 23. 50-50. We were meant to die. Man, we are on a losing streak. But that's half an hour in. I don't think I will start another one. So I'm gonna wrap it up here. I hope you guys did enjoy. They were still fun. We had some f interesting runs. Um, I felt like the relics were really, really good. I hate that we lost the first one. It just wasn't in the cards tonight. But I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.